Well, happening later on this morning, the Kansas Highway Patrol will begin school bus inspections for the Topeka Public School District. KSNT News reporter James Ryan is live in central Topeka right now with details on what troopers are looking for in their inspections and how it keeps your kids safe. That's right, Brittany. Kids are heading back to school next week, and later this morning, troopers are going to be here at the bus barn, making sure all the buses are ready for that first day of school. Now, these are safety evaluations, not mechanical. Troopers will be checking the overall condition of the buses, looking specifically at things like tires, lights, as well as safety features like the horn, doors, and window hatches. Lieutenant Stephen LaRoe tells me it's something the patrol takes very seriously. You as a parent would go and put your child onto a bus and you would hope that that bus was in the best condition it could be to transport your child to school. You're putting some trust into that program that it's going to work. The Kansas Highway Patrol is responsible for inspecting around 11,000 buses across the state of Kansas. Troopers typically start in July and it takes around six weeks to make sure each bus is ready for kids heading back to school. And you can check on this in a number of ways if you want to check on your kids school bus. One of them is there will be a sticker. You can see right here there's a tiny sticker. It's blue. This year it is maroon. It says that it has been safety inspected and another way is you can also request that safety report from your school district. Live in Central Topeka, James Ryan, KSNT News. We certainly appreciate the update this morning, James. Thank you. The Topeka Public School District inspections will take place this morning at 8 o'clock over at the Kansas Central School Bus Center. We have posted the checklist, as James just said, that troopers are using when they're looking over the school buses this year. You can find that on our website right now at KSNT.com.